It's meant to be 42 degrees today. Yeah. Which is not a temperature I've ever encountered in my life. No. So we're gonna not push ourselves too much. Um, we're gonna get some autos everywhere. We're gonna stop and get some cool drinks and enjoy yeah. some AC when we need it. Because otherwise, we, mostly me, are gonna get really grumpy. Um, but I think we're gonna go and check out the Gandhi Museum yeah. and- Yeah, that's pretty much most of our plan for today. And maybe go and get some nice bites to eat along the street as well. Yeah, it's gonna be a good place for getting good snacks. It's like a foodie kind of place yeah. in India. So we'll try and get some good food. It's really, we're like staying right near the bus station, so it's really noisy. I don't know if it comes out on the, yeah. on the video, but um, it I'm seems kind of very hoping, manic here. Doesn't it, it seems really manic, but I don't know if it's just because we're staying on this street by the bus station, and it might get quieter like in other places. But yeah. who knows? I mean, this is India after all. Hopefully, we think we know where it is now, so we should be able to find it. So here's our hotel. Here is the fire station. And there is the tourist office. We literally just walked like an hour out of our way. So that was sort of a success. We managed to register on to the festival tomorrow to go and see the wedding ceremony which sounds very interesting. We can't take our phones, we can't take our cameras, we're going to have to leave them back in our room. So we're not even allowed to take them in, even in a backpack they said. And unfortunately the day after is this big festival where they have these big cars which are like temples on wheels which drive down the road we're actually taking a train at one o'clock in the morning and that means we'll actually miss everything that's going on here but you know you can't see everything and we've got other places that we need to go and things that we need to see so i think we're going to try and grab some lunch now before we head over to uh, one of the other temples I think what I ordered was some kind of parotta, like bready item stuffed with some mutton I think. I'm so glad I did a bit of research this morning because I never would have ordered this because I had no idea what it would have been. But it's, I think it's called the Ceylon Mutton Parotta and it's really delicious and this is probably one of my favourite things that I've eaten in India. It's exactly like hot oven steam during your face. Yeah, really hot. But 
it's at least we don't have to do the walking to get to where we need to go. So that's the upside. So we've just got to the Gandhi Memorial Museum and entry is free, which is a real bonus for us because we like free things. And it is actually an old palace, I believe. And it's quite a big museum, as far as I'm aware. And it's one of three in India, which covers Gandhi's life and things about Gandhi. But we're gonna go and have a look and see what it's all about. We've just come out of the Gandhi Memorial Museum. It was really interesting actually. It's super long history. Goes All about, yeah, like the Indian independence from the British and how Gandhi played a big part in that. It's especially important here in Madurai because this is where, one of the places that he came to visit, he visited a lot of places in India, but this is where he like got rid of his fine clothes and donned his cloth to like be a part of the people. And it's really, really good museum actually. I really recommend it. Yeah. And it's free to go in, you just have to pay a little bit if you want to use the camera in there, which we did pay. Yeah, and you can give a donation at the end as well if you want to. Which is really nice. But for now, I think we're just going to head back to our hotel, sort out the situation with our room because there was obviously a problem where they didn't have the right room and then they needed to move us. And yeah, and then probably just chill for a bit before the weather cools off just a little bit before the late evening. Yeah. have got back to our hotel and moved rooms and it was actually really painless and they've actually put us in a much nicer room. Yeah, much nicer. There's uh, it's a lot smaller, which would sound like worse, but it's a lot better because I think the AC is going to work better and I think the AC unit itself is better. Yeah, and we have, the bathroom is also way smaller and much cleaner. Yeah. Like the bathroom in the last place was boiling hot, I think it was above the kitchen and it just smelled of like food and like Sewage and like, yeah. it was really great. And the floor was super slimy, like you couldn't really stand up, yeah. it, you just slid around. So yeah, we're quite happy actually with yeah. coming back and sorting that all out. I think though it's still a bit hot outside, so we're gonna chill out here a bit. Hopefully, you know, the AC kicks in quite well. Still very noisy outside, as you can probably hear. Yeah, but I slept with it first last night, so I'll do the same again today and yeah. that's fine. But once we've kind of relaxed a bit and cooled off, we're going to then probably go back into town, see if there's some other nice food we can have and just have a look around really. So we've been at our hotel a little bit longer than we said we would be. It's now 6 p.m. So we've also been looking up some places to go and eat. So we're gonna go and grab some food and have a look at Madura in the evening.
So I'm not exactly sure what it is. I think it's like a vadai. Like made straight just now with some coconut sambal on the side. Really nice. These are the things that Jenny really likes. They're normally quite bready. But these ones are actually quite soft and light. It's really tasty. stepped into the restaurant, we don't really know what we're doing. We're just kind of waiting to be told what to do. We've been given some banana leaves and now we're hoping for the best. And just tuck in. Oh, it's more. Oh, careful, it's going to fall off the table. <laughs> so from the outside it doesn't look all that much, it's just kind of tucked in the corner and you sit down and we didn't really understand what was going on but we sat down, they gave us a banana leaf, they brought us some things, we had an onion uttapam and we had a ghee dosa and it was really really nice, super tasty. And you just roll up your banana leaf, carry it over to the bin and then you wash your hands. It was really nice. But I think it's kind of pretty much the end of the night now, it's getting late so we're going to probably make our way back to our hotel, call the night because we've got an early start tomorrow. We're hoping to go to this festival and we probably won't be able to take any videos or photos at all until the afternoon but we'll see what we can do.